Hello everyone, uh, it is currently Friday, I'm having my second day of chemotherapy after enjoying a day off from it yesterday. Uh, I'm feeling pretty good at the moment, not nauseous or anything like that. Currently just enjoying some vegetable soup supplied by the hospital, uh, as well as a very healthy smoothie made by mum. Uh, mum's been here with me for the last week, staying up at the uh, click house that we saw in the last episode. And uh, she's just been doing homework and whatnot. Yep, studying for her, uh, her anatomy <laughs> and physiology test. <laughs> that is all. And welcome back. It is 8 o'clock on Wednesday evening. Um, so, I finished my last day of chemo on Sunday. Didn't actually throw up once, which I'm quite proud of. And then Monday night, that turned out to be an exciting night, because uh, they wanted to give me a new antifungal drug called Ambazone. I'd never had it before, I'd always had uh, posaconazole in the past for my antifungal needs. But they gave me this um, Ambazone on a on a drip for like a little 15 minute taster session because some people react to it. So they did that, no reaction, so alright, fire away, hooked me up for the hour bag and uh, it was just going away until there was like four minutes left on the bag and then my face started tingling and I was like, what's all this? So I thought nothing of it for the first minute or two, I was thinking to myself, let's just see where this goes and then sure enough, I gave one of these, I went and I was like, yeah, my tongue's definitely swollen. So, um, Dad was in the room at the time. I said he was trying to get me to decide what I wanted to eat. But my mind was obviously on this whole swollen tongue issue. I'm going like this, like, Dad, I think my tongue is swollen. Which, you know, is cause for some concern. So Dad went out and grabbed the nurse. So all the nurses came back in. They uh, gave me the antidote, as it were, which was like hydrocortisone and pyroton, all of which were IV, you know, get into the bloodstream quicker. And by this point, like, the right side of my tongue was swollen, and this uh, side of my cheek as well. Um, and then also my lip, sort of further down there on the inside, was uh, starting to swell up as well. So that was exciting, but after administering the antidote, it all sort of settled down again and uh, I wasn't about to suffocate and die. So, good news all around. When the doctor came in later that night, he was like, you've had a stage one anaphylactic shock. So I was like, pretty cool. Not cool, no, not cool. Um, exciting stuff anyhow. So the morning after that, which was Tuesday, uh, it was time for my DLI, which of course is donor lymphocyte infusion, and that is a little bag of IV, which is lymphocytes from my donor, and uh, that just goes in the uh, the old line, as all my IV things do. I've got a nice sleeve for it now, so it doesn't jangle all around the place, but there they are. So that goes in the line. No, actually, they didn't do the, uh, the infusion in the line, for risk of it getting blocked. Uh, with, with cells and stuff, they put a cannula in me, actually, for that. Uh, which I was fine with. If it's just five minutes, I'm fine having a cannula. Uh, as long as it's no more than that. In a week or so, you know, those cells will start kicking in and hopefully we'll be fighting back any residual leukemia that's left after the chemo. Hopefully that is zero, but 
it's better to be safe than sorry. So we got some defensive cells up in there, and now we're just waiting for the chemo to do its stuff. So my neutrophils are still at uh, 0.6 today. We gotta wait for them to go back down to zero, and then I can't be discharged from the hospital until they're up above 0.5. So as far as uh, treatment goes, that's about it. Uh, on the diet side of things, we've been carrying on with that healthy alkaline diet, getting lots of greens and, you know, homemade juices, smoothies, a lot of healthy stuff. Uh, if anyone has any questions about that, feel free to ask them in the comments and I'll do my best to respond. So I can't really think of anything else that's coming up now. Not my cell count, that's for sure. Gotcha. That's going, because it's going down. That's, that's the joke. Right, yeah, that's enough of that. Bye.